going to see if I can get a decent shot here and do a video for you guys on the different settings that are available in the Ford specific menu for Blue Pilot 1.1. The first one is Show Hands Free UI. That is showing the Blue Cruise display on the gauge cluster. So if you have an F-150 with the digital 12 inch gauge, no physical tack or speedometer, you can use that. If you have a Ford Lightning or a Mustang Mach-E, you can use that. If you have an Expedition with the digital dash, you can use that. If you have any other vehicle, it probably won't work and turning it on might cause some funny things on your dash with regards to animation for lane centering and uh, lane keeping. Uh, the second two are send uh, signals to the vehicle. This is so that if the comma wants to tell you to put your hands on the wheel or uh, watch the road or that you're drifting across the line, it normally flashes the screen. It will also send the equivalent forward message to your dash cluster. And then enable human ter turn detection. That is the um, fix that's been in Blue Pilot for a while where if you make a turn and you have MADS enabled or you're in experimental mode so that laterals engage when you make it, it resets the steering so you don't get wind up and um, it continues to turn after you've started going straight. Uh, the next section is the lateral tuning section, which is probably what most people are gonna be most interested in. Uh, lane change modifier. What this does is it applies a multiplier of less than one to the desired curvature when you're changing lanes. Currently, this has been built into Blue Pilot at a fixed 70%. Uh, now you can adjust that uh, down to about 40% all the way back up to 100%. So if your lane changes still feel too harsh, you can make that variable lower, lane change modifier. Uh, the next two are low and high curvature PC factor, where PC is predicted curvature. So these are the two you're going to modify if you're wanting to adjust uh, ping pong or bouncing in the lanes. So low curvature PC factor is what's going to be applied on straightaways. High curvature PC factor would be what's applied in uh, curves. So uh, I'll put a link in the description of this video to a forum post I did with some pictures explaining what predicted curvature is, what um, desired curvature is, and how those affect ping pong for forwards. Uh, but those are the two factors you're gonna tune if you're having problems with ping pong. Uh, if you get these variables too low, excuse me, too high, if you get these variables too high, what you'll see is at first you'll get into a slow ping pong. You go from a fast ping pong to a really slow one where maybe over as much as a half a mile you'll see it bounce side to side. If you go even higher beyond that, what you'll find is that you won't even be able to stay in the lane on straightaways. You'll start to drift out of your lane on straightaways. Uh, the fourth one here is high curvature factor. What this does is if you're in a curve it applies a multiplier of less than one, so 90%, 95%, whatever, to try and help if you, your vehicle is taking turns too tight and it's cutting, cutting to the inside of the curve. Um, so you'll be able to adjust that from about 80% to 100%. And of course, everything here is in decimal, so 0 0.65 is 65%. Um, below that, it's just some monitoring data that you can play with and see what uh, the data is spitting out, what it detected for your car, uh, some of the, the variables that it's calculated. So you can look at those. Um, one quick note on this UI, uh, it's a little bug we haven't been able to work out, but when you first install this, all the variables are zero. You need to take one drive where you engage Open Pilot before uh, the default variables will call up. So once you get it installed, take one drive, then you can come in here into the Ford menu and start adjusting your settings. So hopefully this, uh, you know, gives the, those of you who are using uh, comma three or three X with your Ford, uh, some ability to tune some things to your liking and make a better driving experience.